Let's start some farm chores. First, the broilers. They are out back on the sod and they are messy little buggers. again. I'm not touching the broilers until I can use some kind of vehicle to move them and pull them. Um, I'll get back to the broilers later. Maybe it'll dry out a little bit because it's been raining for days. Let's start the other farm animals and get them fed this morning. Good morning ladies. Do you have any eggs for me? Do you have any eggs for your mom? We'll peep in on Winston and the new goats for a second before I feed them. Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. It's windy. Hi. Good morning. Winston. Winston, good morning, sunshine. I'm also feeding my spring chicks that I've got at TSC and also from Myers Poultry. I have them in that producer's pride brooder and I'm also feeding them this 30% as well. I moved them into my barn because they were in my garage and they were starting to get a little noisy. Let's see how they're doing. Hi guys. So dusty. Bit. Now we've got to put a couple drops of your chicken elixir in there. This is chicken elixir. It is from Strong Animals. And it's a water additive that supports their digestion and their egg laying. And it smells like oregano. Just a couple drops. Now, on to the quail. Hi. 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 Hi, good morning. Hi, babies. Oh, hi, Jess. Hi, Jess. Check the chickens now. I'm gonna have to feed them first. You're driving me nuts. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. See what the ah! Your horn. Those are horrible. There. Sacks. Maybe they'll leave me alone now. What are you talking about? Huh? All right, now food for chickens. So the goats hopefully will leave me alone and let me go feed the chickens and check on them and make sure that their water's okay. But this is our crazy zoo. This happens twice a day. When I check on, 
I only feed the goats and the pig and the chickens and the quail once a day. I feed the broilers twice a day. So they're the only animals that I need to go out and double check. Yeah. Ah! He's got food aggression and he's about to pick. Whiskey, that's not nice. Oh my God, and they're on me. They're on me. Girls, stop. Girls. Making this difficult. Can you please move? Maddie, move. Nope, you're not going in here. No one gets to come in here with me. Nope, not a Huey, not a Maddie, nobody. Sorry, Charlie. Hey, girls. Your big feed trough is inside your house now, huh? Let's use this one for now, okay? want? What do you guys want? Strawberry? Strawberry is my pretty girl. Miracle and Huey. Look. Look. See this? Look. Ready? Go get it. There's nothing in it. You just had your food. You've got a big pasture full of green what? stuff. Yeah. You have it. I want to show you something about Whiskey Boy. He does that to the chickens and to the goats, but he would never do it to me. Watch. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. See, so I don't worry about the boys with him. We just have to always make sure that there's no goats behind us or chickens behind us so we can't try to kick. See, you're a good boy. I'll leave you alone. <laughs> Enough of whiskey. Let's go try to feed Winston and then separate him from the goats because it's kind of hard to get him separated. Then he busts out of this little kennel area that I have him in when I feed him. Maddie. Maddie. Just help yourself, buddy. Just help yourself. Is it good? You wanna stay in here and eat that while I feed the other goats? Okay. Excuse me. Okay, excuse me. Maddie. Maddie, can I have some of that bigger goat right now, please? You can stay in here. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna take this and feed everybody else, okay? Be a good boy. I'll uh, see you in a minute. Maddie is so cute, you guys. Like, so cute. So now I've gotta try to feed the goats and then get the pig away from the goats to feed him his food. Of course, Tom's right behind me. So let's try to get you guys away from here. Let's try to get you away from the from the gate. Tom, stop. We'll just try to put a little pile everywhere. Okay, now that gets them away. Look at this mess from all that rain. Oh, how'd you get out, sweet baby? Yeah, you keep getting out. They keep getting out right here. They're pushing this. Yeah, I didn't know you were out. Come on, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good baby, good baby. And now, I can feed them. I stopped raining so we can put this back this way. Because it won't gather up. Here girls go. I said, Wilbur, you're Winston. Come on. Come on. We're going to have to get you a separate little area, aren't we, sweet boy? Well, if you're 
you're wondering what I'm gonna do with all of these new goats that I got, I'm gonna keep them in the butt pen for one month. During that time, we're gonna make sure that no one's sick, no one has any issues, any kind of illnesses. Once they're done with their one month quarantine, I will put them back over with the other minis. But for now, I'm just enjoying them. They're starting to come around a little bit more. They're not that friendly, but they're not horrible. Girls! They're not like mine. They don't come up to you. They don't beg you. They don't lick you. They don't try to have you pet them. They're kind of just here right now, but we're working on it. Oh, you're a good girl, Bonnie. You're a sweet girl. start over. Here is my chicken tractor. Here are my heavies. I am not going to fall again. It's rained for days. That's what the problem was. Look, it was slippery and slimery, but here we are on fresh grass, no falling down. Now we can take care of these baby chicks. Well, that was just a day of chores. Wanted to share it with you. Wanted you to come along, kind of get an update on what's going on here at the homestead. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't hit the little subscribe button, please hit it and go ahead and hit that dingle bell so you're alerted every single time we upload a new video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.